hello everyone, Lonely Farm Guy here with a new mod test for Tuesday, April the 12th. And uh, we have here the self made cow shed by uh, Didic96, 8.13 megabytes to download, one slot for the cow shed, and it actually comes with a manure um, bunker, uh, which is three slots. And we will look at these um, both. Now, first of all, the cow shed, 45 cows, um, and it will hold 21,375 liters of straw and 33,750 of uh, any combination of TMR, hay, or grass. Now, uh, one thing to note, this overhang and the trigger, uh, the trigger is very close to here. It's not a generous trigger. You're going to need a side tip or something, a very low trailer. Uh, anything that tips up or anything is going to interfere with this overhang. So it's quite tricky to load in uh, food. Fortunately, it's not a large amount. So both the straw and the, the, the TMR or the straw and the food both load at this trigger here. Quite a bit in here. Like you got to stick it right in there. Um, okay, so having said that... Uh, we're going to see what the uh, what the milk capacity and slurry capacity is. So we're going to... Uh, uh, oh, the slurry is over here. Actually, uh, you can open the door like so and uh, don't, uh, don't fall in. <laughs> and uh, where do we find them? Yes, good question. Uh, we will find them under animals and under self-made cow sheds. So 45 cows, which is actually... We look at uh, the the in-game one, 254,000, 36,000 is a steal at one slot as well. Um, and uh, yes, the water is uh, supplied, so you get charged by you get you get charged for that through uh, uh, by the month basically. Now the silo, the manure plate, as it was called in the thing. Here it is, the lizard, uh, only thirteen hundred dollars. And as I said, three slots. So, uh, yeah, again, uh, super cheap compared to the 25000 you need for that one. Um, yeah, cool. So, cheap, cheap, cheap. A little annoying with the overhang, uh, but we're going to uh, zip ahead in time and see what happens. So... <clears throat> All right, so we have gone ahead two months, uh, gone ahead in time for two months. <laughs> we have went ahead two months <laughs> in the time machine uh, that is this game. And uh, if we look at our animal information again, uh, the milk's up a bit, uh, up to 11,000, and the slurry's 22, and our food's almost gone. So to, it'll, the, 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 uh, the cow shed will hold two months worth of food. So now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to keep this filled and we're going to see what our capacities for slurry. Uh, let's see if we can get, there we go. Uh, slurry and milk. And then we're going to try those triggers and we'll see you uh, when I get that information. All right. So we have finally reached capacity on our uh, amounts here uh, for sure. We have reached the capacity of this manure heap. Uh, that obviously works. Um, and as for the um, cow barn, <clears throat> milk 33,750 liters <clears throat> and slurry 56,250 liters is the capacity of those. Uh, it took several months of just oh, sleeping, sleeping, sleeping. So probably about five, four now five or six months uh, it took to fill those up so uh, oh uh, this is uh, this trailer the side dump it was a base game trailer the Brentner um, it's 25,000 liters uh, this will work here as you can see it just clears if you do it on the side dump like so just barely uh, and it will give you almost 
it will hold uh, 33, so 20, I think it says 25,000 liter capacity. So that one will work. We have an in game tanker here, and we're going to go. Excuse me. Ooh, oh, a little tired. Um, we're going to grab our milk. Let's see. There we go. Start filling. Milk. Yes. So it fills quite happily. Not very quickly. But there's not a whole lot of milk there. So that's not too bad. Uh, now our slurry. Just get rid of our milk here. And uh, just, just for checking sake, let's close that door and see if it still still uh, unloads. Aha. So if you're wondering why Oh, well, this, this tanker probably doesn't take slurry, does it? No, you dingle dingling. Dingling a ling a ling. All right. <laughs> I guess it would have helped if I chose a tank. Uh, I don't think it's missing. No, it won't be. It should be under animals, right? But that doesn't take slurry. No, it does not. Uh, I need to go to slurry tanks. Uh, let's see here. Do we have a... There we go. Uh, this, uh, this is the base game slurry tank uh, for highway tractors, semi-trucks. Does not have a spreader. It is a uh, transport tank only, just so you know. And if we go here, yes, let's just check to see if that door is closed. It'll still fill. There we go, close it. Come up to the trigger, and it still can fill. So it's just a cosmetic... Uh, interesting thing and you just you can you can do that uh, if you have one of those um, slurry spreaders with the with the tube that goes down um, extends and you can you can pretend you're sticking the tube in the hole to suck up the slurry and so forth and I think that's caught got it all covered oh you just kind of fell down there you okay buddy all right um, yeah, so there you go. That's the self-made cow shed <clears throat> by Didic96. 8.13 megabytes to download. Uh, $25 per day upkeep. It's $1 a day for this for upkeep. Uh, $36,000, 500. One slot. Three slots. What else do you need to know? Um, <laughs> yeah. Um, I'm Looney Farm Guy, and remember... It's only a game, so till next time, bye for now.